Ask her. Sh <laughs> shall we ask her? Uh, Sally, we think it's about time the uh, weather forecast was sung. Off you go. Not on your life. <laughs> Gosh, she has to have an audition. I think I'd need one too. We certainly saw a lot of cloud around today, but we should get some breaks in that this evening and tonight. In the northwest, cover could be thick enough to still give us odd spots of rain, but there are prolonged clear spells, but don't forget in those we could get some mist or even fog patches. Temperatures not too bad, quite mild in fact, at sixes and sevens. There wasn't a lot of breeze about today and tonight will remain calm and things will stay that way until later tomorrow. But in the morning after the fog's cleared we'll get sun in the cloud breaks. Still the odd shower pushing in from the west but those will die out as we go into the afternoon. So after lunch more sunny spells but good old cloud pushing in again later. Temperatures are mild again, certainly for early November, but we will get the wind picking up to this 8 mile per hour southerly. And looking ahead to the weekend, well, unsettled really. Saturday looks to be the drier day as more rain moves in overnight and into Sunday when strong winds pick up again, giving us blustery showers. Monday's not so bad, just a chance of showers then. And tonight's pictures got someone wrapped up and ready for that lot. This is by Elizabeth Forbes, age six. Thanks, Sally. Well, a little earlier, we heard from George, the taxi driver, a man with little hope, and I don't think he'd mind us saying so, of landing a million-pound recording contract. But tomorrow we hear from someone who's done just that. Her name is Maxine Chamberlain. She used to perform in nightclubs near her home in Burton-of-on-Trent. She sounds like this. <laughs> 